A man is dead after his crane hit power lines and burst into flames in Brevard County. More than 100 families are still without power. Fox 35's Esther Bauer is live at the scene tonight in Palm Bay. So Esther, some roads have been blocked for hours now. This accident happened at 930 in the morning and crews are struggling to make progress. Now, just moments ago, we learned the identity of the man who died. He is identified as Kester Gittens. I do want to show you just how active this scene is. So right behind me, we have some crews that are up here trying to repair all of those damaged power lines. Other crews are also working to remove the massive crane where a worker lost his life. Kaboom, sound like a bomb went off. Black smoke filled the air as neighbors watched in disbelief. By the time we got out here, we saw it was all on fire and everything. It was just starting to come down when it knocked over the power lines. Palm Bay police say a crane operator was working on new construction at San Filippo Drive and Valencia Street. When the machine ran into live power lines, the worker died on scene. This is just an unfortunate accident, but with all the new construction going on, um, you know, I hope that this is, our, our hope is that this is the only one that we ever have to respond to again. They're calling it an accident, but that could change when... OSHA, fire department, medical examiner, and then the PD review. Numerous workers came out to the the scene on Wednesday and many are devastated. Oh, I was heartbroken when I lear learned that someone actually had passed away during this incident. I feel real bad for their family. Whenever you hit an electric line, that's going to happen. We do have some bad news for families here in this area with how intense the repairs and the removal has become. They're not expecting power to be turned on until 9 or 10 o'clock tonight. Reporting live in Palm Bay, Esther Bauer, Fox 35 News.